Hey, Tyler and Andrew, congratulations on the final season of Letter Kenny. Thank, Thank you. Very much. <laughs> so um, let's look back a little bit. Did you have for both of you a favorite, looking back at the, the whole arc of the series, uh, a favorite behind the scenes moment and a favorite uh, in front of the camera moment for both of you? Yeah, I, I, I have a, I have a favorite behind the scenes one uh, that I haven't mentioned yet today, but uh, we won uh, best comedy in Canada at the Canadian Screen Awards, maybe season two or season three. And uh, we went backstage after winning the award, getting on, getting on stage, having this surreal moment. And then Dave Chappelle was backstage uh, and he had a tray of whiskey. I think yeah. he had shots of whiskey. And he cheers us uh, in a way that only Dave Chappelle can. I'm not going to reiterate what he said today, but he he said words that only Dave Chappelle could. And we cheers. <laughs> we all got a whiskey with Dave Chappelle, and he yeah. shook our hands and congratulated us. And that was a that was a pretty amazing moment off camera. <laughs> yeah. yeah. On camera, um, um, I just for ahead. me, I think just uh, you know dancing with Evan and the boys. It was always fun. They kind of they kind of worked us uh, pretty hard in that dancing uh, dancing regard because it, it it was a hit season one and season two, and then they would just find a cool backdrop and just put the camera on and tell us to dance. So that's kind of what that was. But that was <laughs> always fun. Andrew, uh, I got a I got a couple. I'll go. I'll choose. So the in season one, uh, the show obviously just c came from uh, YouTube, and everyone was kind of feeling each other out. Some people had met, some people hadn't, and uh, you know, the show had kind of acquired its budget that it, it eventually led on to have. But uh, so we had a one trailer that we all shared, and uh, it was just a funny scene where you know you'd have like Ginger and Boots napping. You'd have like Tyler and, and Evan like dancing in their gear and like yeah, Dylan and I who are always in the A top shirts doing push ups and some people be trying to read and have quiet time and then there'd be people howling over in one corner and someone trying to eat in the other corner and uh, it was just like pandemonium in this quote unquote break room. <laughs> and. Um, I just thought it was just like it was it was only that season we got our own trailers after that but. At the time, you know, yeah, sure. Every now and then we're like, oh, what the fuck? Like, we want our own trailer on most face. But then after, you're like, oh, I kind of missed that break room, actually. I kind of was like, uh, <laughs> I don't got to, like, decompress in that room. Um, and it was just hilarious. Uh, I've talked about a lot of on-screen ones, but I, one I kind of forget um, is it's always funny when Tyler or Dylan and I are we're in the shower talking about, like, what we're going to do. We're going to wheel some girls or, you know, get some gains. And then all of a sudden there's – shores the in between us ass over tea kettle like against the wall and it's just like those scenes where we're all in the showers is just it was just always so ridiculous especially because they make you wear and there's no way to put it like a cock sock and <laughs> i remember one season dylan and i were dylan and i were we didn't we didn't tie them up snug enough i guess and uh <laughs> while we were doing our scene and all of a sudden jacob's like cut 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 what the what is going on with these guys dicks like so i guess the water was filling up and they were drooping down like like elf health elf hats and so sort of like, like a stringy dong <laughs> it's just so, so. Maybe there's, there's got to be some behind the scenes footage somewhere oh yeah, yeah we, we need to like, we need that oh, yeah wow. it was just moments where you're like this is ridiculous i feel ridiculous but it was also very very funny yeah so finally, um, being that it's the final season, what do you hope that the fans take away from the whole arc of the show and, and what do you hope they got out of it? Um, you know, hopefully they, they got a lot of enjoyment. Hopefully, you know, uh, through tough times, they can come to our show and turn it on and, and, and laugh. Um, and hopefully they, they understand how important community is and the sense of community. I think our show is was big on that, you know, uh, no matter who you are, you're always welcome uh, at Modine's or, or uh, you know, wherever we were hanging out in that moment. So I think hopefully it brings people laughter in times of, uh, you know, difficulty and uh, a sense of community as well. Andrew? Yeah, I, I think uh, to kind of further add to Tyler's point, I thought, you know, it was a, I was really 
what really made me love the show was how accepting it was of everybody. Um, anyone who had like, you know, was talking bullshit, you got kind of called out immediately. And uh, I just hope the fans latch on to like the, fu like how funny it was, but how, how accepting it kind of was of all the other, of all, all the different types of people and their views. And, um, I just thought it was a very accepting show, very anti-bully type of show. Um, and I think, you know, we could use a little bit more of that in the world right now. It's like, maybe not take everyone, take everything, take ourselves too seriously and just have a laugh and be more accepting of each other. That's a great note to end on guys. Thank you so much for taking time to talk to us and congratulations on the final season. Thank you, Eric. Thanks for watching the You Interview channel. With over 3,000 original celebrity videos, we have one of the largest collections of celebrity interviews anywhere. So remember to like and comment on our videos and subscribe to the channel. If you want to get more involved, you can become a member of the channel. Membership has its perks. You can see exclusive celebrity videos and get the opportunity to ask our celebrity guests questions. We can't wait to hear from you.